This video will cover the topic signed fraction division. In this topic, we will be asked to divide fractions and write our answers as a fraction or mixed number in simplest form. What is a mixed number? A mixed number is the sum of a natural number and a proper fraction. For example, 2 and 1 third, which is shorthand for 2 plus 1 third. 2 is a natural number, and 1 third is a proper fraction. For a mixed number to be in simplest form, the fraction part must be in simplest form. How do we know when a fraction is in its simplest form? A fraction is in simplest form when the numerator and denominator each have the greatest common factor of 1. Those definitions make sense, but can we try some examples to see how they relate to these types of problems? Absolutely. Let's say we are given negative 3 over 7 divided by 27 over 14. And we are asked to write our answer as a fraction or mixed number in simplest form. Dividing this fraction by 27 over 14 is the same as multiplying by its reciprocal. You can get the reciprocal of a number by flipping the number. So the reciprocal of 27 over 14 becomes 14 over 27. Now instead of negative 3 over 7 divided by 27 over 14, we have negative 3 over 7 multiplied by 14 over 27. Next, we can cancel the common factor of 3 in the numerator of the first fraction and the denominator of the second fraction. Similarly, we can cancel the common factor of 7 in the denominator of the first fraction and the numerator of the second fraction. This results in negative 1 over 1 times 2 over 9, which results in negative 2 over 9. And the 2 over 9 is negative because he multiplied a positive number by a negative number, which results in a negative number, right? That's right. Let's try another example. Let's say we are asked to evaluate negative 11 halves divided by negative 2. Since dividing is the same as multiplying by its reciprocal, we should first find the reciprocal of negative 2, right? That's a good place to start. Okay, so since negative 2 is equivalent to negative 2 over 1, the reciprocal of negative 2 over 1 is negative 1 half. Good job! Keep going! Now we have negative 11 over 2 multiplied by negative 1 half. 11 multiplied by 1 is 11, 2 multiplied by 2 is 4, and a negative number multiplied by a negative number results in a positive number. So this means that the final answer is 11 over 4. Very good! The final answer is 11 over 4. In summary, when dividing sine fractions, we find the reciprocal of the divisor and then multiply the dividend by this number. If it is a negative number multiplied by a positive number, we know that the result will be negative. If it is a negative number multiplied by a negative number, we know that the result will be positive. And finally, if it is a positive number multiplied by a positive number, we know that the result will be positive. You seem to have a very good understanding of this topic.